Good evening, everybody. My name is Apocalypse Toast, and my name will continue to be Apocalypse Toast forever and ever. Uh, before I played more Space Engine, I had a, a few th interesting things I found. First off, this blue main sequence star. Now, blue stars in themselves are pretty uncommon. However, look at the shape of this one. It's like, it looks pretty pretty normal looking at the face like this but when you turn it around you'll see that it's kind of shaped like a, some sort of candy like a mento an M&M something like that uh, really strange looking unfortunately I don't really know how to describe it uh, I tried to look on the Space Engine website for information about these kind of things but haven't really seen any yeah, this is a blue star that is shaped like a candy. Uh, there's no planets, which I thought was kind of weird. Maybe that has something to do with it. But that's that. Uh, I also wanted to look at this planet. This is in a globular. So if we go to this, this is some thick, thick-ass rings. Look at them bitches. And there's a little tiny one right in there on the inside, but this the rest of them are huge and they're all various yellow and green colors. Invisible when you look at it this way. But yeah, them them's are big rings. I'm sure somebody can find me bigger. Here's the star. It's uh this is where we would just were a minute ago. <laughs> Okay, with that, let's find let's find a planet with life. And I'm going to use the map. The map. There we go. Uh we're going to zoom out and get to some nearby stars. There we go. I think this is how I found the thick ring. Yep. Still having mouse problems, but that's okay. Uh, triple orange dwarf. <laughs> Eleven. Nine. Come on. Unless we find another blue star, we're going to go to the first one we find with life. If we find a blue star, we're going to go there. Because blue stars can make for some good screenshots. Okay, come on, let's find one. I'm just clicking around random here. White main sequence star. Hmm. White main sequence star. Okay, that's what I expected. Uh, looks like this one's not candy shaped, so I guess white. Uh, main sequence doesn't mean candy shape. This one doesn't have a planet with life. I just wanted to... Uh, I don't know. It seemed interesting. Now it's not that interesting anymore. I swear, every star system always has a gas giant. That's probably not true, but... Uh, in my experience, it is. Okay, I don't care. Oh, I do care, but let's find a different one. Let's use the, uh, let's just click around random here. 22 planets. Wow, I've never seen that many. That's a binary system. It looks like there's three stars in there. What is that? Uh, I'm seeing three. Maybe one of those is far away. Jeez. That's a lot of planets. Here's a Oceania. No life, no life, but Oceania. Moon. Let's go the moon. I don't care about water planets. It's just water and with clouds and hurricanes and who cares? That's a lot of planets. Twenty two planets. Bet we could find more. It would be really interesting to find something like find a an asteroid or a planet like super close to the star. I've seen some pictures of those, but it's a four four star system. 
I've seen some pictures of planets like that, and it's kind of scary looking. Here we go. Triple red dwarf. 13, one with life. Okay, that's... They zoom me out pretty far away when it's at least a binary. It's just kind of weird. I think it could get a bit closer. Okay. Let's, let's take a look here. I better probably this one. Yep. Temperate Terra with life. That's what we would find on Earth is a temperate Terra. That's yeah, a lot of there's some land right there. A lot of water. Hurricanes. If you can get a hurricane, there's the moon. If you can get a hurricane in a screenshot, it looks very cool. Let's take a look down here. What is this? is it Tatooine? We're on Tatooine. Uh, I think I'm LOD minus two. I was playing at LOD two without realizing it earlier, and I did crash. Is that red red blood water? Is that what that is? I think it is. Very very mountainous planet. How hot is it? 291, so that's in Kelvin, so that's around 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Orbital period. They have their year is 130 days, and every day is 20 times longer than it is on Earth. That's pretty long. That's uh, 400 hour days, roughly, and a bit more. 420, 410, something like that. Looks like it's that. I think that's pretty sure that's water. It's just not. It's not loaded in right. Uh, there is a 3D water effect, and I'm afraid to use it because it'll just turn my game into. There we go. Yeah, that looks way better. That is blood, blood red. I think we could take a picture. Where is, let's get a look. The moon is way down on the other side, so we can't look at the moon. How about we speed up the time? I'm a pretty big noob because, oh, I lost control of the, uh, damn it. I'm not clicked on the planet anymore. Hold on, let me find it again. Okay. There we go. Uh... What was I saying? Oh, I'm a pretty big noob because you can push this button and turn and speed up time and you can watch planets orbit around. The clouds are moving. We'll probably watch the sun go down in a minute. Oh, remember our days here are 400 times as long so it might take a bit longer than usual. There's that sun is moving across the sky there. I really want to see this moon rise. Uh, we might not do it. We might not see that. It's going to get dark. Oh. Come on, moon. Nope. I don't think it's going to. I think it's just going to come. It's going to go back and forth like that. It's fucking dark. <laughs> come on. Where's the light? There you go. Yep. So that moon isn't visible from over here. How do I how do I turn it down? Turn it down. Um yeah, we can't see the moon. That's too bad. Let's find something interesting over here. Mountains, mountains, mountains. There's a view of the galaxy. How would you like... Well, I mean, we can see the Milky Milky Way from Earth, but, I mean, it doesn't look like this. That's pretty beautiful. It's this weird kind of, like, desert and water oasis hybrid. Now we're on desert everywhere. Flying into the sun. 
<laughs> this makes me scared. I don't like this. I don't know how to explain why it's scary. It just is. Oh, I might have to stop. Okay, I gotta stop. <laughs> this is the moon. Here's the planet from the moon. Over that way? There it is. Yeah, it's pretty far away. That or the planet itself isn't... Oop, wrong button. The planet probably isn't that big, really. How did it get... Oh, no. Wrong one. Here we go. There it is. Pretty far. Wow, looks like Mars, almost. Except for the big mountains. You know what this game could really use? But I think it would totally tear apart everyone's computer would be some sort of height mapping that's visible when you're looking at a planet from space. So when I'm... Ooh, that's pretty. Those are all lined up. Uh, when I'm looking at a planet uh, and I'm rotating it with my mouse, should be able to see like a big mountain jutting out of it or something. But I think that would definitely, definitely tear apart the computer. Craters within craters. Okay, you know, this was fun and all, but I think we should find something else. And it doesn't even have to be... It doesn't have to be something with life. We'll just find something interesting. I don't want to go to the black hole part, though. That'll scare me. Um, let's just find another system to go at. Let's just pick one at random. We'll go this one. Mm, frozen ice world, frozen gas giant, warm ice giant. No, I don't care. Those are all. That doesn't sound that interesting. A globular cluster. Clusters are... Yeah, let's go to the cluster. I take it back. Let's go there. Clusters are really weird. Um, they're weird when you look at the cluster from a planet within the cluster. Also, this scares me in itself. The amount of stars in this one picture is horrifying. Let's pick one of these. Let's find something. We could probably find one with life here, but... Uh, I don't feel... That's not important. This one. Yellow giant. Desert. Scorched desert. I'm afraid how close that might be from... If it's a scorched desert, I've never heard that. It must be really close. Wow! <laughs> That's terrifying! Oh, I don't want to do this, but I'm going to do it. It's so bright, you can't even see. It's so... <laughs> it's like a Death Star. Except white. That's scary. Yeah, this is what Venus looks like, doesn't it? Oh my god. I think I'm going to just have to stop here. That's what you get to look at. <laughs> oh. Well, I got what I asked for, huh? All right. Um, yeah, we'll we'll stop there. We'll play again next time. Asta.